Okay, in this problem we're given f of x, y, z is equal to the quantity x plus y plus z minus 1 squared. And we want to know where um, f has critical points and if there are any level sets that have singularities. Um, so first we want to find critical points. Uh, we know that the critical points of f are going to be when the gradient of f is equal to zero. So So the gradient vector of f at x, y, z is going to be the derivative of f with respect to x, which is 2 times x plus y plus z minus 1 times that quantity. And then we'll see that the partial derivative of f with respect to y and z are the same. So So we get this really long gradient vector, and we want to know when the gradient is zero. So for instance, if we look at the x component, we see that, or the first component, we see that um, that component is equal to zero if x plus y plus z minus 1 is equal to zero, since 2 multiplied by 0 is 0. And if this is true, if x plus y plus z minus 1 is 0, then likewise each of the other components will be 0. So we found a plane x plus y plus z equals 1 is a plane where um, every point that lies on this plane is a critical point because if a point satisfies this equation, it means it's on the plane, and that means that it satisfies this equation, which means that the gradient vector is zero. Okay, so we know that if P is a singularity on the level set F equals F of P, then the gradient vector of f at p is 0. So this is supposing that p is a singularity. So we want to find if there are any singularities um, on any level sets. So if the gradient vector of f at p is 0, then we're on this plane because we just proved that all the critical points are when the gradient vector is equal to zero. So if a point is on this plane, then that is the only time in which um, we could possibly have a singularity. So we'll look at points on this plane, x plus y plus z equals one. If we figure out what f of p is, so if p is on the plane, then we know that f of p will satisfy the fact that x plus y plus z minus 1 is 0 is equal to 0. So we're looking at the level set where f is equal to 0. And so if f is equal to 0, then we have zero is equal to x plus y plus z minus one quantity squared, which is the same as some function g. Equal to zero, where g is x plus y plus z minus one. So if we remove the quantity squared at zero, these two functions are going to be the same level set. 
So now we've reduced this problem to seeing if there are any singularities on this level set. But if we look at the gradient vector of G, we see that the gradient vector of G at x, y, z is the vector 1, 1, 1, which doesn't equal 0. So therefore, for any point in G, there aren't, or there are no um, critical points of G on the level set where G is equal to 0, and thus there are no critical, or there is no singularity on F when F is equal to 0. So we know that there are no singularities, but there's a whole plane of critical points.